I'm trying not to think about throwing up because I will <laughs> throw up. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, I know it's been a long time, but we're back with another Hot Ones episode. I'm Genesis, and today my guest is Victoria. And how are you feeling about doing this little challenge? I'm nervous, but I'm also really hungry, so hopefully that <laughs> takes the pain off. I don't think it will. I don't think that's how it works. <laughs> but basically how this is going to work is she's going to take a bite of the hot wing, and I'm going to be asking her a question. And it starts to get hotter as you go, so let's see if she could actually answer everything. And then I'm going to be taking them as well also. So, if you want, you can go ahead and take your first bite while I ask you your first question. You want to tell them? Ah, uh, yes. Thanks for reminding me. The first one is slap. Mm -hmm. It's Cajun. I love Cajun, so I hope it's good. <laughs> okay. Get a good bite then? Mm -hmm. All right. So, you're a dancer, right? Mm -hmm. So, what developed your passion for dance and what does it mean to you? good um i developed my passion for dance kind of like over the years Sorry, I'm um when i was little at home i used to always um like watch tv i, I don't know if anyone knows what this is, but it's like on demand so it's like they're playing music videos on cable and so i would always watch those and dance with the people in the music videos and then in middle school, I tried out for my dance team for the first time, and I really enjoyed it. <clears throat> so it kind of, like, got me interested in actually dancing and actually, like, doing more. Um, um, well, actually, college is coming up, and I'm looking forward to um, majoring in dance. I want to be a choreographer and hopefully have my own studio. Let's, I'm actually finished this one because that one was pretty good. How are you feeling about that first one, though? I'll finish it with you. It was good. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> All right. Mm hmm Okay. Once we're done with that, we'll move on to the next one, which is sweet chili sauce. Sweet chili sauce. I don't know how to feel about that one. <laughs> I don't really like sweets, but I mean, it's a sauce, and it's spicy, so it doesn't matter. Okay. Yeah. Are you ready for your next one? Yes. Go ahead. After you. Okay, so like I was saying, dance is part of entertainment, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to ask you a little funny question. If you were part of a circus, what would your circus act be? Like, it could be anything. I feel like it would be, like, those people that yes. swing on, like, the, um, I don't know what it's called. You know, like, those little circles, and you're dancing around it, and you swing? I, would have to look it up. I don't know what it's called, but have your, it's on The Greatest Showman. And Zendaya does it. She dances on that. I'm sorry, I did not like this one. <laughs> not because of the spice level, but because I just didn't like the flavor. It has like a funny, <clears throat> like, you know, I never thought I would do this because I'm very picky and I just, I don't want to feel, I don't like feeling uncomfortable. I'm not but, picky at all. I'll eat anything. But, <laughs> yeah. Literally anything. But for me, circus act. Hmm. You know, oh, I would do like those people on the rings that like, is that what you were kind of saying, yeah, right? the circle thing. Yeah, the circle ring. thing. And then also, like, the curtains. I think the curtains are really cool. Oh, yeah. That takes a lot of strength. Or when I went to Vegas, there were these people in, like, roller skates. I don't know. It was, it was crazy. There's always people in roller skates. <laughs> <laughs> but it was cool. But are you ready? Are you ready? This one is habanero maple syrup. I'm oh, kind of excited like about be this sweet one because it smells like actual syrup. Like it, I'm not excited about that one because I feel like it's going to be too Like, have you ever had chicken and waffles? <laughs> chicken and waffles. That is good. Mm. That one's good. Okay. So, this also relates to dancing, kind of. So, how was homecoming? It was fun, right? It was an amazing experience, yes. Really? How was, like, the after? How did you feel after? I felt... Very sore. Okay. Um, would you actually like to explain this picture? <laughs> <laughs> to show it to the fans. I, 
I have no idea who that is, honestly. Uh, what is what is the context of this? Um. <laughs> okay, this was okay. Um. Well, see, the plan was me and my friends were having a sleepover after homecoming, and we were all gonna watch this movie, uh, the Jeffrey Dahmer Show. Actually, mm-hmm. we were watching that. Um. But I was really tired, and so was my friend, and we were the first people to go to sleep, and unfortunately. Being the first one to sleep at a sleepover, that happens to you. <laughs> and I was tired after the dance, like we were dancing all night. So, <clears throat> yeah. What do you think was the best thing about homecoming? Um, definitely the photo booth that you guys had. It was, I think it was really cute. Are you just saying that? Oh. Or, <laughs> that's what I was doing during homecoming. I was running the photo booth. I was at work. It was a really good idea. Still, picture. Yeah, we <laughs> we're waiting on that. But uh, what do you think about sauce? I really like it. Like I would eat that every day. Like really? it, it literally reminds me of like having chicken and waffles. Cause like on waffles you have syrup and like eat it together. That's a really good combination. I just don't like the sweet taste. It's just not I love it. I I I personally like. I loved the Cajun one. That one was really that good. good. But the sweet one is just. I love but the syrup. So far the spice is not there. I'm not feeling it. It's just not there. Don't, don't, don't jinx yourself. I'm focused. I'm under control. <laughs> I feel fine. So let's mo- move on to, this is Buffalo Wild Wings. They are actually sponsoring this. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> They're not the sponsors. But this one is Island Spices and Peppers Caribbean Jerk Sauce. I'm excited. I love Buffalo Wild Wings. <clears throat> Buffalo Wild Wings, Wingstop, or Epic Wings? Mm, Buffalo Wild Wings. Wingstop is <laughs> Wingstop is second. I've never had the mm. last place. Though. Okay. But Once you can't try Epic Wings, you'll have it above I, Epic Wings. I don't think anything yeah. can top no, Buffalo. They can top, they can top it. See, Buffalo Wild Wings is basically like I'm getting a food. I'm sorry. It's just not. <laughs> it just doesn't hit the same. What? But let's just move okay. on to the next one. So the next one I already said Caribbean jerk. So try it. Okay. <clears throat> there you go. Oh, that one smells so strong. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, so let's hope you don't say Buffalo Wild Wings for this next question. But if you were to meet an alien and you wanted to impress them with a restaurant, where would you take them? An alien? Yeah, like if you had an alien companion <laughs> and you wanted to impress them with a the restaurant that you've been to, where would you take them? Oh my God, this one is so bad. Um. Ugh. Um. <sighs> Like a restaurant, like a nice restaurant, maybe like. Mm. Ooh, this is not really a nice restaurant, but this is like a fun experience for me because I love the beach. Um, <clears throat> so I would say Fred's at Huntington Beach because you go like up these fun little stairs, and then like the whole restaurant is just like crazy designs everywhere, and then like you can either sit inside or outside, and I like sitting outside because you have the little balcony, and then you can like see the whole beach. It's over there. Um, mostly like Mexican food, like they have these huge, and all their servings are like huge, so like size of probably this whole platter right now. Um, they have burritos, they have pretty sure tacos, any, anything. I think they're known for their drinks, so I should get drinks. <laughs> I don't go for we that We can't though. get that yet. <laughs> Anyways, so a restaurant that I would take an alien to, I don't know because I don't really go to restaurants like that much like any kind of food place. Well my mm-hmm. alien where you get your my alien needs to nachos. try <laughs> Mexican food. My alien needs to try Panda Express. <gasps> really? But I wouldn't say that's like the best place to take him. I'm just I think like, Panda Express is really good. It is, but it hits. Like we go to the mall and we get <clears> that, but like it's just mid. Yeah. I like, can have better. Exactly. So restaurant wise though. Oh, I've been to like, Pia Pia Chang's, I, yeah, I've been to like the one. basic ones, like in the area, like Pia Chang, Garden. Oh, do you know what Pia Chang's Town is? Oh like, wait, no, 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 no. Is? It's in, it's in. Mm-hmm. Um, they sell Warner sushi. Valley. Yeah. Oh, that and one I is love good. It there. That one is so good. I'll just take my companion there, my alien companion. Good there. idea. Okay, I, I didn't feel the spice in that one, but I didn't like. I feel like it, it exactly. but the, the taste. No, <clears> never <throat> again. These, I'm not even going to take next a one, second bite. These next two are the game changers, apparently. But I feel like we're doing fine. 
Like, I don't know if Say that now. <laughs> Say that now, and then we are going to, like... I, I'm so, just terrified. The next one is <clears throat> garlic reaper sauce. Garlic reaper sauce. The name is not too flattering. Oh. The California Reaper. But, um, that's like one of the hottest peppers. <laughs> I'm scared. Okay. It's okay. You. Just don't think about it. <laughs> yeah, just don't think about it. I'm gonna it's nothing. Go for it. <clears throat> Oh, let me ask you a question. Okay. Sorry, getting a little more deeper now. So, what has been the most significant plot twist in your <coughs> life? You know, like something random that's happened in your life that something really good or something that you didn't exactly like expect. That's <coughs> amazing. Um. <coughs> something random. Okay, it's picking me. Yeah, it's it. Oh, it's spicy. Oh, uh, <laughs> I can't even stop. Okay, something random. Ah, biting right now. <clears throat> oh my god, you're turning red. <laughs> I'm sweating right now. It's on my tongue. <laughs> it's on my tongue. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> something random. My lips are tingling. Drink water. <laughs> this came out really bad. <clears throat> Good. This actually. Oh my god! It's, no. it's getting worse water. on the tug. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't want to touch my face. <clears throat> Hold on. Just breathe. No. This is not. <laughs> I can do it. Okay. Something random. That's making it worse. The water is making it that worse. That came out really good for me was starting um, vlogging with Genesis. Um, I didn't really expect it to be like a part of my daily routine. Well, not really routine, but like, oh my god, I'm like sweating. Um, <laughs> you're crying. <laughs> <laughs> She's crying. Okay. Um, I didn't expect it to be, like, a highlight of my day every day. But, like, every time I come to school, like, I'm just really excited to, like, be a part of that. And then one thing that really excited me or, like, made me excited about it to keep going <laughs> was when um, one day one of my freshmen in my linker class came up to me <laughs> and mentioned, like, Oh my god. He was like, hey, like, I saw you on the news. Like, I saw your vlog. Like, it was really cool. And at first, I got really embarrassed. And I was like, oh, really? And then he was like, yeah. And I was like, oh, okay. And he was like, it's really cool. And then I was like, oh, like, people actually enjoy watching it. So I'm like, this is turning out really good, you know? So. You're good on without the water? <laughs> no. I can keep going. My lips are tingling as I, I can't. Stop. Like, all it's right here. <laughs> Um, I feel like I just got my lips done. <laughs> oh my god, I just licked my lips. I know that's gonna make it worse. What's something random that but, came out really good for you? Well, I'm glad to know that something that I initiated was something that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! So far, I'm just too scared. Can't relate. Oh, why did I lick my <laughs> lips? That made it worse. Okay. Um, something that I would say is honestly coming to this school because I wasn't from this area and I the last thing I wanted was to change schools from people that I've known since elementary school. <coughs> so it was really upsetting at first. But it turned out really well. One of those reasons being because I met you. And I'm not just saying that because you're here, <laughs> but I, I mean it. Because I feel like you're one of those people that actually brought something new into my life that was really impactful. Mm. These Likewise. are emotional tears and <laughs> hot tears. Um, and then also meeting Mr. Kalantar. I think it was really cool becoming part of this program, especially since I live really close. Because I could be really involved. 
I feel like my whole face is twitching right now. <laughs> if I was still like going to my school like where I wanted to go, I feel like I would be missing out on so much because it's far and I just wouldn't be able to be as involved. But yeah, <laughs> I'm like, <clears throat> like, yeah, <laughs> I'm dying. I'm really thankful for this class and for you. And it's not Thanksgiving <laughs> yet. <laughs> and yeah, I think that plot twist of me thinking I would hate it all four years ended up changing junior year and this year because I'm, I'm loving it. <laughs> I'm loving it here. But anyways, <laughs> it's a good school. The staff <clears throat> are amazing. Oh God, I'm not let's, ready yet. <laughs> Let's, um, let me ask one more question before we went to the next one, because I need a little break. Mm -hmm. um, what do you think is the best and worst thing about getting older? Um, I feel like the best thing would be like getting to become of age to do more things and like... <clears throat> well, being able to like God, hold on. Um, also, like, growing up, I feel like it just feels good to grow up and just feel older and, like, feel more mature. I feel like I really like that growing up, like, I'm more mature. Um, but also, the scary thing is definitely graduating high school, <coughs> to have your own responsibilities. <laughs> um, and, like, just college, moving away from, I mean, I moved away from all my childhood friends after eighth grade. I had to move here for the first time, like you. Um, and also just moving away from all of you guys and the school. My dance team after this, um, it's just going to be really emotional, and that's the hard part, and being on your own. I mean, I love to be alone. I'm a very independent person. But I just feel like on another level, that's going to be so hard. For the best thing, I think kind of the same thing. Like you got to experience more things, and just do more with your life, and really start pursuing your passions that you had as a kid. And for worst things, is yeah, the future is scary, and it does terrify me a lot sometimes because I enjoy being able to see like my friends every single day. Mm -hmm. I look forward to it, <coughs> and so just the thought of like not being able to have that those experience every single day is like really terrifying at mm -hmm. times and like I, it just makes me rethink about quarantine i hated yeah. not like being able to socialize every day and so that's scary and then also i feel like as you grow up excitement kind of leaves like for specific things like holidays for example because you're more it, you're just so used to it and like yeah the excitement just dies down like this is our last christmas as kids <clears throat> This is our last Christmas as children because we're being adults. We're going to become adults this year. <coughs> it's really de devastating. <laughs> devastating for sure. And I feel like it's a whole different experience because it's not the same. Like, um, And also, it's like you're not waking up to pick, like open toys or like, yeah, it's just different now. Like all it is grow growing up also, like throughout the years, like when you're little, your Christmas wish list was toys. And as you get older, it's money. Money, money, <laughs> money, gift cards. More materialistic things. Yeah. yeah. Like my whole face is like twitching. <laughs> I still like just tear it up. I'm yeah. surprised I haven't teared up. I started <clears throat> feeling it, but you're turning red, but then it went away. I don't know, I felt my face just like tense up. Is this the next one? I'm scared for the next one. I feel like I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna I'm already need, crying. I'm gonna need the whole jug of milk after this, like we're gonna need refills on the water. I'm gonna finish this. Y'all better have this prepared. Like, yeah, get the we're milk ready. Milk get the milk boy. ready. I'm serious. Yes. Oh, no. I know what to expect. No, you but don't. But then again, oh, it's this is the one. The bomb. This is the bomb. Literal bomb. What? What is beyond okay. insanity? I'm gonna read it. Okay. <laughs> She's gonna read the nutrition facts. It says caution. First of all, like <clears throat> this is. Do you want to do this one at the same time? Yes, please. Let's do this one at the same time. Oh my gosh, that's so red too. I'm just gonna take a small little bite. You ready? I can't take a small bite. Everything just is red right here. Cheers. No, wait, oh my. <laughs> we need to mentally prepare for this one. <clears throat> I'm scared. I'm shaking. Go, ready? Just go. Just go. Okay. <laughs> <I'm gonna> <laughs> okay. 
Okay. <laughs> okay. Why does mine look darker than yours? This is unfair. Ready? Shaking. Literally shaking. Okay, ready? Go. <laughs> Okay, guys, I, I promise I'm gonna do it. <laughs> okay. Okay, ready, for real, for real. One, two, I'm gonna like start cursing really bad if it's really hot. Wait, Bleak I'm gonna do it, it on this side, because this side looks like really drippy. Okay, ready? Go. You're cheating, you didn't eat the whole bread part. I ain't come that. What? Wait, I don't feel it yet. Should I wait? No. I'll take a mm -mm. bite. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. You're gonna be dead. You're gonna be dead. Mm -mm. <coughs> the question is, I'm sorry, that's so disgusting. What is something that means a lot to you that no one understands? Mm. I feel okay. Oh, that is a, oh my God, wait. Stop, that's so nasty. I'm confused. I feel fine. <laughs> I'm okay. <coughs> Wait. What's the next question? What is something What's that means a lot to you that no one understands? Um. Oh. Wow. Ah. <laughs> My dog. Your job? <laughs> <laughs> My job. Oh, wow! <laughs> <laughs> I feel it. I feel like I'm choking. Uh-oh. Mm -mm. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna throw up. <coughs> oh, this is so... <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Wait, count our. Okay. Oh, the milk is making this really nasty. Throw over there, Janice. Just please throw over there. <laughs> oh, I gotta stand up. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh my vocals! I feel like my throat is like. <coughs> <laughs> oh, why did I do this to myself? I just burped and then it hurt. <coughs> I'm rethinking like everything right now. Oh my god, it's so bad. Mm. Oh my gosh. I can't talk. Mm -mm. <sighs> oh my gosh. You took that whole thing. You shouldn't have, I told you. I don't want to throw up. <coughs> I just need to like breathe. I can't. <sighs> I can feel it. <laughs> okay, guys. So, the what was the question again? What's <laughs> something that means a lot to you that nobody understands? Um. Um. I'm trying not to think about throwing up because I will <laughs> throw up. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. 
Mm. It's in my eyes. <laughs> Ow! It's in my eyes. <laughs> oh, oh. oh no no no! She almost just threw up on my face. Oh, for my eye! <laughs> no, I'm fine. <clears throat> okay. I feel like... Oh my god, why is this still coming? That one was so disgusting. That... Hold on. Okay, something that means a lot to me. Mm -mm. I feel like every time you talk, your air, the air just dries up your mouth and it just makes it worse. <sighs> oh, my stomach hurts. Mm -hmm. <sighs> it's so nasty that like it makes you want to throw up, but then it, like the spice just, oh my god, it just kicks in. Oh, my stomach hurts. Can you talk? Can we talk? Mm -hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Something that means a lot to me that what no one else understands. Um. <sighs> um. Probably. I would say my dog. Because my dog, he looks like a mutt. Like a, what is it called? Like one of those, oh my god. One of those um dogs that, uh, that you see like on the side of the street. And you're like, oh my god, like it's cute, but it's not cute. But like it's like a little homeless dog. But I think those dogs are cute. I think any dog is cute. <laughs> Bring your little chihuahua and your little dog, like anything. I will pick up any dog, like from the street, but make sure they're clean. Um, but my dog, we got him a while ago. He was pretty cheap. Um, and his name is Bacon, and no one likes him, like in the household besides my dad. Everyone thinks he's like ugly, and I'm like, he's a dog. How do you not like? <sighs> How do you not like a dog? So, um, he's my best friend. Um, he lives with me, and he's my emotional support dog. Yeah, yeah. No one understands the love that I feel for him. I mean, it's the world to me, and I will cry the day he passes because he's getting pretty old right now. Are you okay? You're you're dying more than I am. <laughs> that was really nasty. Have a little uh, milk. Yeah, you can see. Yeah. It hurts my stomach. Yeah. We're, we're going to be on this for hours after this. <laughs> <laughs> we are. I'm not even going to lie. <sighs> oh, she's, I just, she's going in for another one. It's not like the heat anymore. I just feel. My my stomach and my 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 mouth is tingling. Like my tongue is tingling. My body just hurts. My every time I talk, my tongue gets dry, and the spice just comes on the top of my mouth. And, oh, that hurts. Uh. Yeah. Excuse me. <sighs> okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I wouldn't say this is something that people don't understand because it's not like. I, it's like people do it. Oh. I don't want to throw up. Okay, stop, wait. <coughs> I really hope it's Because then if you throw up, it's going to make me throw up. Because if I see someone throw up, oh my god, just thinking about it. I see throw up. Something? I'm going to throw up. Oh no. Wait. Oh no. 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 I can't watch her here. I can't watch her here. Yep, I'm going to throw no. up. No. Wait. <coughs> <coughs>
It's like all liquid. <laughs> Sorry, you did not need to know that. <laughs> Are you gonna throw up again? No. Oh, uh, it wasn't the heat anymore. I think I just the milk was really gross. Ew, don't, please don't speak about it because I will throw up. <laughs> okay, anyways, what I was saying. <laughs> this is quality I content. I have the chills, look. I have the chills. <laughs> I am <laughs> <ready>. <laughs> mm -hmm. Just smelling it makes mm -hmm. me want to throw up. Just smelling the hot sauce right now. Anyways. What is, okay, yeah, something that means a lot to me. Okay. So I wouldn't say, like I said, people wouldn't understand this. I love to really hold on to, like, I hoard things. Like, the most random things I will hold on to forever. If you give me a rock, I will hold on to it forever. If you give me a note, obviously I'm going to hold on to that forever. I do that too with birthday cards. But even, like, doodles. Like, like for example, <clears throat> in my notebook, sometimes my friends and I will draw random things with each other. And I will hold on to that too, because I, mm, I love memories. I love everything about that. I print every single one of my pictures, and my parents are like, like, you have your phone for that. Like, yeah. why do you print your pictures? Well, and I'm also, like, I get it scared. Anyway, storage. <laughs> anyway, storage. I'm shaking. You good? Yeah, that's um, why I got the chills. <laughs> But I print every single one of my pictures because I always get scared that something's gonna happen to them. Yeah. I wish I could print that. out videos too, because mm -hmm. I don't trust. I don't trust like I mean hard drives or like USBs or whatever. <clears throat> you know what I've always wanted though, like um, have just a plain wall in your room, and then have a projector, and you can play videos and movies. All of that. Stuff. <coughs> <coughs> Yeah, I, I'd say that. I hoard things. Like, there was in fourth grade, <laughs> my crush gave me a little name tag with my name, like, and he, like, designed it for me, and I still mm -hmm. have it. <sighs> and I haven't talked to him in a while. That's not the point. Um, <laughs> um, now that we're here, Shout let's just answer crush. my extra questions. What is one of your proudest moments? One of my proudest moments? I would probably say stuff. I have like multiple. Um, I'll just say one. Just um, last year for showcase, um, it was my first showcase with the dance team. I had um, I had one showcase before this. But this <laughs> was during quarantine, and like it was a, just a tough year for everyone, like the coach, the people, and I felt like it was just like a horrible, like everyone was down during quarantine. Um, but next, the next year we had our other showcase and it just like, it just really, it was like a proud moment. Like we worked all year for that moment and like so many practices, so many hours. We stayed to like, what, latest, like 10, nine, something like that. We stayed really late at the school and just like all the, all the hard work and effort and everything just came together after the show and just seeing all the it's crowd so and everything just so like proud of us. Everyone was just so proud and everyone loved the show. That just like made me feel like really proud of the dancers, of the team, mates. Just feels it just feels really good. Yeah. Um, something that I would say is honestly everything that I've been able to accomplish in class. You know, um we talk <laughs> We joke about this sometimes, but during quarantine, I failed this class. But I was lucky enough to be taken back after begging my counselor and Mr. Kalantar. And it all paid off because I ended up becoming you know, the president and oh, doing uh, big things. <laughs> and joining like competitions and doing things like this. <clears throat> and having big projects coming up too. <clears throat> and oh yeah. my god, I just burped, threw up in my mouth. <laughs> that was so disgusting. Yeah. And Ugh. and yeah, I I felt like this class changed a lot of things for me, and so I think. Yeah. Three seems like a very fun class. 
<laughs> See, it gives you chills. It makes you cold. One last thing. What is a small act of kindness that you'll never forget? That I have done? That someone has done to you? Oh, that's hard. I can actually answer that one. For me? Um, no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, something I did, of course. No. Um, it was freshman year. Um, I Like I said, I hated it here. <laughs> so I would just not put in effort like at all. And I would be late to school every day because I'm like, I don't want to wake up and go to school. And then one time it just got to the point where like I started getting in trouble for it. And it just kind of turned into like this argument. And I got like to the school really upset. And I started like breaking down. And I was on my way to my class. And I was like couldn't control myself. Like I was just really emotional. And some girl, she came, comes out like to go to the bathroom. And she was like, are you ditching? <laughs> and, I'm like, and I'm like, no. Because <laughs> I had a fall. I was starting to calm down. And then she's like, are you ditching? And I'm like, no. And I started crying and crying. Oh. And she's like, oh my gosh, are you okay? And she started to come from me. That, like, I'd never met her. I didn't know her. <clears throat> and she was, um, ooh. <laughs> and she went in to tell the teacher, like, that I needed a minute. And she just stayed with me until I was able to, like, be okay. Sweet. And then she, like, walked into the counselor's office. Yeah, you and oh, no, that one of my biggest like regrets, like I think about this so much, is that like I was never able to thank her, and it makes me so sad. But that's nice. definitely like just a little thing, like just being little there things was meant a lot to me, and it helped a lot. The little things. I matter. just wish I could thank her, but I maybe she'll haven't see seen this. her. If haven't seen her since. Here, <laughs> if she still goes here, maybe she'll see yeah. this. I don't know. I haven't seen her since. Um. Yeah. I think. Uh, an act of kindness that I won't ever forget was pretty recent. Um, me and my dad, we went out to go get crumble cookie, um, which is one of my favorite to go to. I go very, very, very often. Um, and I remember we went, and he had lost his wallet the other day for that, so he had no card, no ID, no nothing. And nowadays you have Apple Pay. And not every store takes Apple Pay. So we were like, we didn't have dinner. So let's go to the pizza place right next to it. So we decided to walk in. We ordered our pizza. We just got two slices and two drinks. And then we go up to pay and we see a sign that says no Apple Pay, cash only. Mm -hmm. And so we just looked at each other and we were like, oh crap, what are we going to do? Because we already ordered the pizza and then they already had warming up and stuff. <coughs> so then we waited and my dad told them, he was like, hey, like I didn't see your sign until now. I lost my wallet. I only have my phone and you guys don't take Apple Pay. And then they were already closing. It was like 7.50 something, and they closed at 8. And so we just waited, and they were like, you know what? It's fine. It's on us. And they got two slices of pizza and two drinks. Okay. They sell pizza at Crumble Cookie? No. No. Wait. Wait. <laughs> the place next to it. Oh. It's called um, New York Crust Pizza. Oh, is that like what that? you were talking about the whole time? Yes. Oh, sorry. It's, just... like, it's like right next I to think. Crumble, and then like... I'm looking There's at you, but story. sometimes I can't hear you. <laughs> yeah, but that was very sweet of them. Like, I felt really good after that, but then kind of, I kind of felt bad. I'm like, I'm eating free food that I didn't pay for. Like, it was nice. Listen, it's nice. There's a lot of that. little things. That yeah. But yeah. Um, I feel like I've cooled down. My stomach is just like. I feeling just, terrible. I you let it stop. all out, so you're good. I can't stop shaking, though. <clears throat> I don't know what to say. <laughs> Did you want to add on to anything or ask anything? Um, how was your experience with throughout this whole? <laughs> I don't know. How was my experience? <laughs> it's interesting. Yeah, for sure. I'm surprised. Shout out to Nova for holding my hair back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I had to run out. <laughs> I had to run out. I don't know how Nova did that without throwing up because if I am in She was a room, laughing! <laughs> she was laughing! <laughs> no, if I am in a room with someone throwing up and I hear them or just see them and like smell, okay, the smell of throw up gets me. I will throw up with the smell of throw up, with the smell of dog food, with the smell of cat food, with the smell of dog. I don't want to say the S word. <laughs> Dog poop. Dog poop. <laughs> Dog fertilizer. No, that's you know the funny part though? I took else. I took a little bite like manure. you. Manure. Right? Dog manure. Manure. I took a little bite like you, right? And I didn't feel anything. And you just so went I ate all the whole in. thing. <laughs> yeah. 
and it did not help. I I took a baby bite. Well, I didn't take a baby bite. I took like a decent half bite, but like <clears throat> that. No, I don't know how you did that. Oh, this was quality content. I did it for the vlog. <laughs> did it for you Do guys. it for the vlog. Do it for the vlog. For you but yeah, guys. I guess, I guess that's a wrap then. Yep. We did it. Good job. That was good. I one. may have thrown up, but <laughs> wait, did you throw up on your hand? No, <laughs> I, no, we're good. I'm clean. We're, we're good. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm gonna have to wash this. Lots of mocos went on to this today. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But I'm starting to feel okay. I just feel really shaky. I need like a hug or something. Cause I'm Cool. Okay, but anyways, we hope you guys enjoyed. This was quite an Don't experience. Try this at sure. home. Don't try this at home. Have supervision because. <laughs> Don't try this <laughs> at school. Try that school. No. <sighs> yeah. Hopefully, there's another one soon. Next, a brave contestants. But as of right now, <laughs> we got people in the back that want to try it. Yep. Yeah. Yep. It's yep. fun. Good luck. But it's, Good it luck. sucks. Good luck. But yeah, that's all. We hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, guys. Ew! My stomach really hurts. <laughs> 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 no, I don't want to see my throat.